I am Saij and welcome back to my channel SciTech where in today's video to compare the all the three Bluetooth earbuds so which is the best in terms of the quality, in terms of the connectivity, in terms of the battery life, in terms of the build quality, in terms of the price range, everything I'll try to discuss in this entire video. So make sure to watch till end of the video friends in case if you want to know advantages and disadvantages of each and every earbud that is what I'm going to talk about. The so first is the Mavi Duopods A25 and second is the Soundcore Life Note and third is the Realme Buds Q2. Yes, I do have the three different different companies or uh, earbuds with me and let's see which for which earbud will be having the really good uh, in terms of the value for money that is what i'm going to discuss in this entire video so a quick note first thing is that i'm using the soundcore life Q, uh, life note from the first uh, day it launched in the flipkart yes i think it's kind of close to uh, 14 months or maybe uh, 15 months of usage with the soundcore life note and even the maybe duo pods as soon as it got launched in the amazon i did order that i've been using for the close to 30 days or 35 days and realme buds q2 as well it's i did order i think two days back and this is my 48 hours of usage i'm just trying to explain my usage and how much time i did spend with the earbuds as well so first let's start with the price range the maybe duo pods a25 has got the price of 1299 and second is a soundcore life note which has got 1199 1099 999 and third is the realme buds q2 which is 2499 so in terms of the price point of view the mavi duo pods is the lowest one which you can actually get for the very le really less price and second is the soundcore life note and third is the realme buds q2 so next in terms of the connectivity in terms of the connectivity friends bluetooth 5.0 bluetooth 5.0 and bluetooth 5.2 yes in the realme buds q2 it's got upgraded to the bluetooth 5.2 that is the one thing which you need to uh, take a note at the realme buds q2 as well that's the one good thing with the connectivity so next regarding the sound quality the maybe uh, duo pods a25 has got the 6 mm drivers and next is sound core life note which has got the 6 mm drivers same kind of drivers is found in both and third is a realme buds q2 which has got 10 mm drivers yes that's a quite advantage when you compare with those two uh, earbuds that's uh, one thing in terms of the sound quality so next in terms of the sound quality basically i did prefer the realme buds q2 after using the lot of uh, song listening songs and bass effect is really great in this phone if you try to use a realme link application so there you do get plenty of options regarding the sound you can actually get a noise cancellation and you can get the bass boosters and volume enhancement that's a really good advantage with the sound core buds q2 which you do get in terms of the sound quality so in terms of sound quality i did prefer the realme buds q2 overall in terms of the quality wise in terms of the codecs what what type of codecs uh, all the three supports let me need to connect to my smartphone and show you exactly which phone has got what type of codec level so right now I connected to the Realme Buds Q2 as you can see which has got the AAC codec with the Realme Buds Q2 as you can see friends this is the one thing so even though it's in the case but still I can actually connect it to my phone that's another good ad advantage with the Realme Buds Q2 that's really great and now let me try to uh, use another thing which is a Soundcore Life Note let's see this this earbuds what will be the codec value that's what I'm going to check what kind of uh, thing will be there let me try to Soundcore Life is right now connected as you can see let me try to quickly uh, show you so in the Soundcore Life Q10, as soon as you connect uh, the Soundcore uh, earphones, you do get this kind of message from the Qualcomm in the OnePlus device, which I did connect right now. And you do get this kind of uh, Qualcomm's aptX audio. So this is the aptX audio is supported in the in this phone as you can same phone I'm trying to use. Meanwhile, same phone I'm trying to use, show you. So Realme Buds Q2 has got the AAC kind of codec and this Soundcore Buds, they do get the aptX audio codec from the Qualcomm, as you can clearly see. Now let me try to connect the Mavi Pods. Let's see Mavi Duo Pods, what will be the what will be their uh, codec value that is what i'm going to exp explore in this kind of testing let me try to unplug this one let's see after removing this whether this will be connected to this uh, phone or not let me try to quickly press on this one right now i did remove the maybe duo pods out of the case and i should be able to connect to the maybe duo pods i think they are connected to the other device that is the reason right now let me just show you in this phone what is the codex as you can see aac so overall you're getting aac from the realme buds q2 and you're getting aac from the mavi duo pods as well but you are getting qualcomm aptx from this uh, soundcore earphones so these are the codecs about this all the three earbuds which are supported and next is a gaming in terms of the gaming absolutely friends the realme buds are really advantage because there is a gaming mode which is available in the realme buds application you need to enable that gaming mode as well so you do have this kind of option in the realme link application if you enable the gaming mode will be slightly better in the realme buds q2 there is a one advice which, which i can definitely give you if you are trying to plan the for the gaming so that might be kind of good 88 milliseconds in the realme buds q2 
So next, these two earbuds are not that great in terms of the gaming. I did ex experience a lot of problems as well. Sound delay as well in the sound life note. Even a lot of other users also mentioned the same thing. So next, move to the next thing in terms of the sound quality. First, the Remy Buds Q2. Second, sound core life note. And third, Mi Duo Buds. Yes, this is what I, I will recommend the sound quality is in terms of uh, bass effects or all those details. So first, Realme, then sound core, then Bot. So sorry, then Mi Duo Buds. And third, Thing, uh, which is a major thing which is a battery life battery life uh, the movie duo pods offers 30 hours and 7 hours so this one 40 hours plus 7 hours this one 28 hours plus 5 to 6 hours of battery life i'm getting 6 hours i think overall uh, in the realme buds q2 so that's a range between the battery life of these three cases now let's check the weight so weight which one will be really less weight that is what i'm going to check right now uh, single bud i'm just uh, trying to weight only the single bud so the Mavi Duo Pods has got 4 grams and Soncore Life Note, let's see, 5.3 grams, Soncore Life Note and third is our Realme Buds Q2, let's check the Realme Buds Q2, 4.6 grams as you can see, 4.6, slightly little bit kind of a medium. So all friends, the less weight is of Mavi uh, Duo Pods which has got a really less weight in terms of the build quality. In terms of the connectivity related to build quality of the case. So build quality of the case, these are the, all the marks as they happen around this one. As so in terms of the build quality, it doesn't feel kind of premium kind of uh, quality, but still for this kind of price range, I would say definitely kind of okay. And the magnets are so really strong enough to uh, take the earbuds from different kind of height as well. That's another thing which I thought of showing you right now, as you can see. And in and even the below base also really good. So it's really a uh, frame and steady on the table when you try to keep the earphones on the table. That's the one thing which I thought of mentioning. And Sound Core Life Note, which has got really good, uh, very big, as you can see very big case as well that's the kind of thing and even earbuds as do have the really strong uh, overall magnets and i'm using these earbuds for a very long time so 14 months 15 months is not a joke friends still they are really great in terms of the usage overall and realme uh, birds q2 overall i did like the design and but only thing is that the bottom one is not that soft as you can see so sometimes this can be kind of really uh, disturbing on the table the other other birds doesn't move really much but this realme birds q2 will definitely move on the table as you can see it's kind of annoying so i'm not sure why they did keep this kind of a design that's kind of moving always everywhere that's the one thing which a lot of just mentioning for a lot of other users so this can be kind of really helpful for few users in case if they are planning to buy it so in case if you have any other questions regarding the earbuds, so make sure to let me know in the comment section below. So that will be really uh, interesting to see. So in terms of the sound quality, the Realme, uh, sorry, the sound core life note, which has got kind of close to medium kind of sound core, I would definitely say. So the price range and for the battery life and the sound quality, it's kind of really worth uh, for this kind of value for money, I would say sound core life note value for money in terms of the battery life and build quality and everything, keeping that in point. And maybe duo pods is not that great in terms of the sound quality. Yes, friends, it's not that great when compared with other realme buds q2 and all so this is a reason why i did not give that much kind of rating for the mavi duo pods as well so first sound quality i do prefer the realme buds q2 so if you use a realme link application that will be really biggest advantage so second is the sound core life note so that is the second uh, my option will be there and third will be the mavi duo pods in terms of the sound quality so battery life section all the three buds are having close to close uh, range of battery life there's nothing much change and uh, nothing uh, major we can definitely say and co voice quality also really great in two in two earbuds realme and sound core is really great in terms of the voice quality we do have the four microphones two for each and the mavi duo pods it's not that great in terms of the voice quality as well that's the one thing which i thought of addressing here so all friends the realme buds q2 is the first my choice and second is a sound core life note and try to avoid the maybe maybe duo pods if possible i do know the price is really low but still you should consider the quality as well what you're getting for the price so that's it friends thank you for watching this video and make sure to check the links in description for more information and these are the three birds uh, review for the first time which i'm trying to do in my channel so three birds together as you can see friends and see you in the next video friends until then stay tuned bye